Hey everyone, how's it going? I'm Assassin Magic. Been a while, hasn't it? So, I broke the screen to my laptop, which I used to record and edit all of my content, and that wasn't the best. Cost me £90 to get it repaired, but I'm back, and I'm returning to you with another commentary video. This time, we're going to be talking about the literal Third Reich of YouTube. So they're scrolling through Reddit and they've got this post about someone who has killed themselves because of a video directing hate towards their channel. Uh, the person who made that video is the person who has made this tiny little Reddit video here. His name is Kill Yourself and it says in brackets it's his fifth main account because he's been terminated four times, probably due to creator on creator harassment which as you may know is against YouTube's terms of service. So basically what this guy does is he's got this little army of fascists and neo-nazis that he sends them to go and harass people's channels after he's made a video on them. He cyber bullies people uh, to the extent that they kill themselves and after they've committed suicide he and all his little cronies will celebrate it like it's fucking thanksgiving or something. In fact if you go to this guy's channel you'll notice the for new visitors tab it has literally got a video of him celebrating someone's suicide that he and his friends caused. You literally can't make this shit up. So anyway after witnessing all of this I decided to let him know that I was actually going to make a video on him just so he was aware, and before I could even get to work on this video, he uh, released two videos on me. And um, let's uh, let's just watch them together, shall we? So this first video is called Generic Commentary Channel Number Seven Four Nine Two thinks the commentary community is his own personal army. And oh boy, look at that like to dislike ratio. It really isn't going very well for you today at all, is it? And I've never said that I think the commentary community is my personal army. Like, how narcissistic would you have to be to say that? I said that the commentary community would be made aware of you, because I know of a couple of commentary YouTubers that I've interacted with, personally, and <laughs> that's all I said. I never said, oh, I've got a personal army. So he's scrolling through a reply chain that I started on his video when I told him I was going to make a video on him and the commentary community might be made aware of it. And he's scrolling so fucking fast that everything genuinely just blends into one fucking language. You can barely read anything. It turns into a fucking snake tongue. It's like a YouTube comment section version of Jojo Siwa talking. I like how he just stops for a bit on my channel and it's just just you got the Indian man there just like give me brick I must eat houses I'll give you this though I do need to change that channel banner that is a fucking terrible channel banner hand in my stocking and pull it out yeah I'm, I'm gonna be completely brutally honest here unfiltered I already do not like where this is going. The tone in his voice, the way he's pronouncing his words, everything is just off. Not to mention what he is. So he comes onto my channel and dislikes as many videos as he can without even taking the time to watch them. And he just writes on the first one, oh, imagine trying to be a generic commentary channel. First of all, believe me, I know, there are hundreds and thousands of us. We are a parasite. We are the bottom of the gene pool. Or at least we were until you guys showed up. And I may be a generic commentary YouTuber, but at least I don't heart my own comments. Seriously, you go on this guy's channel, he hearts everything he writes. Like, how narcissistic do you have to be? Recently asking me, Pyro, can I use your content? Can I use your video? 
in my video. And my answer to all of them is pretty much, yeah, go for it. You know, you can even monetize it if you want. It's not like I'm going to be... So this mad little kid's dislike rampage continues. And then he goes on to say the most generic, unintelligent, uncreative insult to ever exist on the internet. He literally just says, dumb video. That's it. That's all he says. Like, okay. But you haven't even watched it, dude. You're like three seconds in and you've already decided it's dumb. That I mean, you must think Pyrocynical's dumb because I haven't even spoken yet in that portion of the video. Wow. Oh, shit, boys. He disliked the Onision video. Wait, I made a video calling Onision out for being a child predator. This guy disliked that video. Does this guy support child predators? Oh my god. Allegedly. Allegedly. Right? Allegedly. FBI, open up! I want you to imagine it's night time. You're enjoying a nice calming walk on the beach. All of your worries are fading away and all the tension in your body begins to go. An intense feeling of relief. Come your entire channel is literally every single commentary channel that fails. Just stop. Okay, first of all, he's, he's technically not wrong. That is a very good description of my channel. However, your channel revolves around manslaughter. You, you convince people to kill themselves, and then you celebrate their suicide. Uh, if, if I had the choice of having a channel that revolved around being essentially a dead meme, or revolving around manslaughter, I'm, I'm pretty sure which one I'd choose. And then in true major asshole style, he ends his first video by calling me a poo skin supporter because I'm a member of the Black Lives Matter movement. Okay, pretty fucking racist, but okay. Hey, stop! I, why? I just don't get it. I always catch you fuckers watching this sick shit. This is sickening. I, I haven't been to bed. I, I've had enough of this. I just want to, I'm going to open this box. You can stick around for that if you'd like. But that's not it, ladies and gentlemen. No, 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 no. I'm pretty sure Kill Yourself Fifth Account is actually head over heels in love with me because he made a follow-up video where he went and stalked my Twitter. It was very, very romantic and I definitely won't file a restraining order whatsoever. Well, looky here, he figures out that Scott and Felix were the ones to give me this idea. Big up Scott and Felix. So I wouldn't be surprised, given that Felix made a video on this guy, if he tries to, like, make a video on Felix. It, it genuinely wouldn't surprise me. But don't worry, Felix, man. I got your back. Hey, guys. So I woke up today to realise my channel had been hate-bombed, dislike-bombed, rude comments... And it's all from the uh, neo-Nazi group that I tweeted about sometime last week. I haven't gotten around to making the video on it yet. I've been dealing with a lot of IRL stuff. Uh, but in between my picking up my repaired PC and this IRL stuff that's been going on, uh, it has been my channel has been dislike bombed. It has been hate bombed, all by these neo-Nazi dudes that I'm preparing to make a video on. So. If you could go over to my channel, show some support, i greatly appreciate that. Thank you. He then proceeds to show my Twitter video of uh, me asking people to show support on my channel due to all the dislike bombing it was receiving. Uh, yeah, and what point are you trying to make here, KYS? I'm pretty sure back in the day when Leafy and Keemstar had all that fake drama, Leafy would like ask people to like the video at the end because it was going to get sworn in dislikes. Pretty sure Keemstar did the same fucking thing. 
Like, wh what point are you trying to make? Are you trying to say that this isn't normal behaviour? Because this is like basic YouTuber behaviour, mate. I, I don't see what point you're trying to make here. And that's the pretty much the end of both videos, but I'm left with so much left to say. First of all, he does all of his videos vertically, which is just cancer in and of itself. He doesn't seem to edit anything whatsoever, uh, which is also, once again, cancer. Um, he also makes videos like two times a day or like three times a day sometimes. Like, do you have nothing else to do in your life? He turned around to me and he said, oh, your, your channel's dead. You, you basically don't get any views. Uh, whereas my channel's booming. Like, mate, the only reason your channel is booming is because people hate watch you. The majority of people who watch your content probably want to fucking kill you in your sleep. They don't enjoy watching your content. They just come to leave comments to be a dassive dick towards you because you're being a dick in general. At the end of the day, I make videos because I enjoy making them. It's not about views. If I gave a shit about views, then... I probably would have left this platform long, long ago. To be honest, I'm probably going to die out soon anyway, because Susan is purging all of the commentary channels, and Leafy was recently terminated, but hey, go out in a blaze of glory, as they say. You've gone out of your way to cyberbully two people to the point that they want to kill themselves, and then after they've taken their lives, you make YouTube videos celebrating it. At one point, I, I genuinely thought that us commentary channels were the true cancer of the internet, but it, it turns out there's something more cancerous than us, and it's channels like yours. And that's pretty much it. Uh, once this video has gone up, I'm gonna block KYS and any of his little buddies, his little cronies, his little henchmen. Um, and that's, that's all. We'll go back to normal commentary soon, and peace out, suck my cock.